As you guys probably know right now, I am 100% free to play in NHL 24. Honestly, my roster is starting to come together. I got enough players to do the X Factor choice set and ended up with an Alexander Ovechkin. We did all the icon moments and got a Peter Forsberg. We have Willie O'Ree from the pre-order, Marty St. Louis from the pre-order, Malkin Kessel, and then lines three and four could certainly use some work. Our defense is not ideal, but honestly, we've been winning games, so I'm just going to keep it rolling. But today I'm going to talk about a mode that not really really many people are playing and that is hut rush hut rush has received absolutely zero updates from nhl 23 to nhl 24 but it may be the best mode for free to play players in 24 as you can see i have 20 unopened packs and each and every one of these was from about an hour and a half of playing hut rush so today i'll walk you through the advantages of hut rush and why you should be playing it as a free to play player also we're going to be putting two packs on the line so i got two of these jumbo premium packs one for each each game that we're going to be playing if i win i keep it if i lose i discard everything inside coming over to hot rush there are two different modes the first one being a 3v3 draft on the outdoor full-sized ring the second one being a 3v3 arcade mode this one is just chaos but most importantly here are all the rewards in hot rush especially in the lower tiers these start out as just guaranteed gold players which help out your team a ton especially early on in hockey ultimate team but as you complete objectives and rank your tiers up these actually turn into some decent pack towards the end. You get a couple guaranteed power-up collectibles, which is how you upgrade each of your players here in Hut. There's a couple jumbo premium packs, which we'll be opening today, and a mega pack there at the end too, which is a solid pack to get your team started. The objectives in each mode are so easy, and you'll complete them just playing the game. What I do is come down to play CPU, put it on rookie mode, and just go through these as quick as possible. For the arcade mode, these are a little bit more difficult, but definitely still easy. The most difficult one being the lacrosse deeks i know it's kind of a bug right now you can score the lacrosse goal and they don't count towards the deke so i had to score like 10 lacrosse goals for it to count as the four we're gonna hop into an online game in each of the modes again one pack on the line for each hopping into our odr game first to wish me luck all right here we are our first game on the beautiful odr now i'm not gonna lie the lineups are horrible so basically you get one hut headliner pool and card which is solid and then all the rest of your cards are like low level silvers low level golds so we got to do some work with some lower overall players here we're taking on the pittsburgh penguins in an absolute battle we're just gonna have some fun man dangle around a little bit and uh probably end up scoring a michigan or two what a dude what a move that was i found that it is near impossible to score goals especially even on rookie mode here in hut rush it is near impossible to find the back of the net so it's gonna be a grind like this this might just be a one goal game especially since it's only two periods here in hut rush but uh we're gonna do what we can and have some fun all right he's got some dangles as well this is gonna this is gonna be a battle of a game dude i like this i like this here we go he's going with a little spinner we're just gonna sit in front make sure you can't go for the cross crease I mean, still the cross crease is the main way oh, that you score goals. I almost got quadruple spin moved. He wants to go for the quadruple spin move. Yep. Perfect. Okay, that, that's self fit. Back to pull in. Boom. Nice shot. Another one. Boom. No way that doesn't go in. Yep, perfect. And pull in's gone. Little spin move. Yep, perfect. What a pass. Go ahead. Go ahead. Why is he so slow? Dude, he is skating in quicksand. How am I supposed to get a B-way goal if he can't even get one step when he has a 50-foot head start? Double side step. Go in front. Pull in. Pull in. One period done. Okay, it's only two periods, so this is going to be so fast. We almost get the back of the net with, with pull in twice. One at the end of the game and then one off the pipe there. A lot of action in the first intermission, though. Like I said, one goal wins this game. I, I can basically guarantee you that. I am still using the total controls, but I, I haven't decided if I'm going to stick with that for the rest of the year. If you guys didn't see, I posted a tips and trick video on all of the different new total control settings. There's so much confusing with it. So I think we got to the bottom of it. If you have any questions about the controls whatsoever, uh, there should be the answer for you in that video. Good poke. I mean, he still does not have a shot off of this. Nice pokes and we're gone. Okay, a little two on one. I need to get the puck to pull in. Pull in is no way to be found, unfortunately. We're just gonna rip it high. Yeah, a little bit too high. Obviously, using these lower overalls, we're gonna we're gonna have to miss the net a few times. Ew! Ew! Oh! Again! Get the net! Dude, we have like six different chances, man. How does it not go? The net's sitting there wide open. Oh, pull in's gonna work. Okay, hold on a second. Back in. Again. Pull it down. Goalie's down. We, we just cannot hit the net. Pouin is doing work here, though. Nothing crazy here, boys. Nothing crazy. This is 
like I said, these are the only two packs that I really get for the entire week. So we absolutely have to win both of these games. Nice poke. I don't even know how we got a piece of that. Let's find pull in. Let's just... Now we have pull in. Maybe. Perhaps. We do. Okay. Little B-way. Pull in. Spin move. Ooh. Still can't find the back of the net. Pull in. Find the back of the net. Uh oh Two on one the other way. 40 seconds. Again, it is only two periods, I believe. I, I think it's only two periods. We're going to find out here soon. Good D. I hope that we get an overtime. I actually don't think I have had a tie in Hut Rush yet, so I don't know what's going to happen if we go to a shootout OT or what, but we do have to get there first. Here we go. Pull in. Ah, five seconds. All right, we're going to OT. We are going to OT. It is 0-0. Zero, zero. We've had our chances. We just have not been able to bury it yet. Okay, second intermission. I'm, I'm pretty sure it's only two periods. I, like, I'm not positive, but I think this is going to be a next goal win situation. Okay, yeah, so it did jump straight to OT there. All right, here we go. OT, one goal to win the game. This this could be, we could be looking at like a 45 minute game here. I, I, say, I tell you what, it's so tough to score goals. I hope I don't get scored on this next shot now that I said that. I got a bad feeling. Uh, let's just get the puck off, uh, pull in. Yep, great poke, great poke. We're gone. I tried to force that pass across. Actually kind of ended up working out though. If pull in join me. I don't know why, it seems like pull in is on defense. Like, she's just, she's staying back so much. Boys, it is time to make history. Our first Hut Rush video on YouTube. Oh, I should have sauced it to him. I thought about it. I just figured he'd get a stick on that. We don't even need pulling. <gasps> Boom. What are these saves? We got full pressure, though. Yep, still with it. Still with it. Pulling. It's in the net. <gasps> oh, what a save, dude. He gets another desperation save with the full pressure on. 12 seconds. We're going to have one last rush. We're going to have one last rush. Here we go. I forced a pass. I mean, that's all I could do. We're going to double OT. Holy. Unless it's a shootout. It might be a shootout. Oh, give me a shootout, honestly. I would take... Okay, it's not a shootout. Continuous three on three OT. We're in OT two. Yeah, that's a good pass. We should be able to... Oh, oh. I don't know why she had so much speed there. That's the one that goes in. A greasy five hole shot with my goalie in perfect position. Dude, I had so many chances on the other end too. And we are gonna have to quick sell the entire pack as Puen, Puen was flying. Like, I, I, I'm kind of there too. Just finds a way to sneak it in. I don't know how it finds a way. We take our first L. This is going to be the first pack of our free to play series that we just have to completely discard. No matter what is inside, we are getting rid of it. Now it is time to come over. We have our arcade game. If I can go one and one and at least get to keep one of the packs, we'll be fine. Maybe the Gretzky's in pack number two. Hopping into an online game. It is one period, four minutes. That's all it is. All we got to do is score one goal. It's GG's. Oh, here we go. Game two, little hot rust threes. Dude, this intro song goes hard. Was this in the game last year? Maybe I like turned it off. I don't know. Kind of goes hard though. We do have a better lineup for game two. That's the good news. We actually do get all gold players. I have Barkov, Yossi, and uh, Pasta in the lineup. All right, let's get it here, fellas. We need to win this game. I'm not going to discard two packs today. I can guarantee you that. Now this is uh, threes, which is just absolute chaos. And for some reason, again, I don't know why it is. It is still impossible to score goals in this mode both hot rush modes very very difficult especially when you're playing online against actual decent players this guy has dry saddle on his lineup solid pull for him from the draft we are going to win this game i think it's going to be decided by honestly like the quick rushes if you can make a big hit like if you go for a big hit check like boom okay i, I wanted to get that quick rush and then get a two-on-one the other way but instead we completely missed the hit also, where I don't know where his third guy is. Where is his third guy? His third guy must be up the ice somewhere. Oh, let's see. I want to see what's going on down here. Oh, he was stuck in the net that entire time, I guess. Completely lost. We're going to have a little one-on-one. -on -one. Let's go a little sidestepper. Where where did Yossi go? I'll take it, though. I mean, realistically, cross creases are not... You're just not going to... Okay, cross creases are going to work perfectly fine here in arcade threes as uh, he finds a way to bury that one. We're down one. Here we go. Okay, cross creases are key. If he's going to score some cross creases, I have no problem scoring some cross creases as well. We got bailed out on that save. Let's wait a little bit. Yep, perfect. Okay, we should score this. I I don't know. I, I, I just got caught from behind. I had so much space and it, it just lost it. Yep. Yep. Mark off. Mark off. Still loose. Oh, I'm flopping all over the place. And now he has a two-on-one. Dude, the AI are super weird. They, like, don't take the two-on-ones. Like, if Yossi's on a two-on-one... <gasps> 
Yoshi, see, like, Yoshi went backwards there, dude. I had a free cross crease, and he just went back to his point. Gotta tie this game up. I'll force a second OT. <gasps> yep, go ahead, Mark. Okay. I will take the guaranteed goal. All right. I, I don't care if it's cheesy. I'm taking that guaranteed goal all day. I'm not losing both packs today. What a finish from Barkov. We got our goal. We're tied at one. I'm winning this game in regulation. We are not going to a second OT. Barkov, a little behind the back. Okay, I tried to go behind the back. Didn't quite work. This is kind of working, though. I, I think I drilled that into my guy's face. Let's go. 2-1. 13 seconds. Game on the line. Yossi. Oh, Yossi. Try, try to get fancy. Hold on. Yep. <gasps> Let's go! I don't think I've ever been this fired up for a hot rush victory. As time expires, we get the back door. 2-1 game. Let's not say anything yet. There's still time on the clock. Six seconds. Nothing back door. He's going to force the back door. We cover that all day long. Throw that puck out. <laughs> that was the craziest diving animation that I have ever seen. If he tied that game up because of my stupidity, I would have never heard the end of it. What a win, though. All right, so we end up one and one on the day. We're going to have to discard our first pack. We get to keep our second pack. All we can do is hope that our good cards are waiting for us in pack number two. What a game. What a win. Let's see what we get. Okay, some tough games today, to say the least. I thought we were going to a second OT for sure, but we have two of these jumbo premium packs i don't know the odds of these packs but we at least get 20 items nine players for our guaranteed gold now these are all untradeable so if we get an untradeable wayne gretzky in this first pack we are gonna have to discard it that is the beauty of free to play this year it's gonna be exciting each game means the world we're popping into our first pack cue the epic music all right this is our discard pack here we go Everything on the line. All I want to see is the... the uh, listen, I'm fine with getting rid of these low 75, 76 overall players. If we get rid of some silvers, that's fine. All I want to see is 74 overalls and we are chilling. Now, I'm not going to lie. This is a lot of gold players to just throw away, especially because we can use these for sets and whatnot. But hey, we'll take it. Gabranson might be the best pull that we get coming in at a 77 overall. Let's keep going here. Three cards left. There's a Ryan Reeves at 79. And our last two, as long as there's nothing good on the final card of this pack, we are safe. Last one in three, two, one, go. A captain. Hey, we don't lose anything. We lose a 79 Ryan Reeves. We lose a Gabranson. The bad news is like we do have to discard this and all we get is the 750 coins, which is from the 750 coins. We would get a lot more if this was a tradable pack, but it is what it is. We'll get rid of all this. We lost the game. We'll discard it fair and square. Now is where it actually matters. One jumbo premium. You guys saw how bad the first one was. Let's be honest, but I'm feeling something different here in pack number two. Let's Let's keep this rolling. Wish me luck here, fellas. We're looking for 80 plus overalls. Any 80 plus overall and we're happy. An 83 and it's a dream come true. Now we do get an icon, which I believe we'll be able to use for an icon trade-in set at some point. So that is not a bad pull, all things considered. Keep on rolling here. Obviously the overalls that we are getting thus far not ideal by any means. Bryson coming in at a 77 overall. A nice Selly there, a little fist pump Selly. Final two cards and our last card is a 72 overall. Now, this is the thing with the free-to-play pack openings. We're going to go through many and many of these pack openings without getting anything, much like we did today. But when we finally do get something, it is going to be magical. So that is it for today's video. We gave it our all. We lost a tough one in OT. We won game number two with time running down. What a day it was. If you guys are free to play, I do recommend hopping in Hut Rush and at least doing all those objectives to get some free packs. That's going to be it for today's video. If you did enjoy, hit that like button, hit subscribe. We're on the road to 1 million subscribers, and I'll see you guys next time. Peace.